I'm Rob Woodfield with the Orange County Register and welcome to OC in 2 for Friday, May 1st. Prosecutors have charged Michael Petronella and Devon Kyle, a husband and wife from Laguna Hills, with 106 felony counts related to failing to pay workers' compensation insurance for their roofing company employees since 2000, a scheme they say cost insurers $38 million. Their attorney says the couple, whose bail was set at $3 million apiece, intends to plead not guilty at their arraignment on May 13th. During a raid on their Tuscan-style villa, investigators found Kyle's application to star on The Real Housewives of Orange County, inspiring District Attorney Tony Rukakis to dub the case the real insurance fraud of Orange County. Also seized in the raid were $50,000 cash, $500,000 in jewels, two Ferraris, a Bentley, and a Range Rover. In Newport Beach, a motorist was killed this morning after a utility truck flipped over just before 8 a.m. on the northbound 73 toll road just north of Newport Coast Drive. At 7.55 a.m., the CHP received a report that a white truck hit a guardrail, went over the right shoulder and overturned. CHP said rescue workers tried to save the driver trapped under the truck, but the coroner's office was called to the scene at 8.20 a.m. No other vehicles were involved. The CHP has issued a SIG alert because the number three lane is blocked off. As soon as today, test results are expected to confirm that two Irvine men, a 26-year-old man and an 18-year-old University High School student, are Orange County's first cases of swine flu. Thursday, the county's health care agency announced the two likely cases, adding that both men had recently traveled to Mexico, but that they do not know each other. County officials decided against closing University High School, saying enough time has passed for others at the school to get ill if they were going to. The 18-year-old has recovered and is back at school. The 26-year-old man is recovering at home and has received antiviral medication. As of Thursday, California had 16 confirmed cases of swine flu and 41 likely cases, with eight people hospitalized. Authorities seized more than a dozen rifles and handguns during an early Thursday morning raid that spanned Orange and Riverside counties and targeted a small Santa Ana gang. The raid was the result of an investigation which began April 10th when a patrol officer stopped a car carrying three gang members and found several large caliber military style weapons. The weapons recovered in the raid have an estimated value of $12,000 and will be tested to see if any of them have been used to commit crimes. Two men were arrested in the investigation, 31-year-old Rudy Vasquez and 18-year-old David Ortega, both of Santa Ana, and police continue to look for an additional suspect. The Gang Homicide and Felony Assault Reward Program offers people up to $50,000 for information leading to the arrest of a gang homicide or felony gang assault suspect. And you can read more about all of these stories and get your breaking news all day at ocregister.com.